Right, yo guys, what's going on and welcome back to um, episode 2 of the Aberdeen Cream mod. I'm doing a host of on this, so I'm not doing this live. Hey, surprise, you know, we sound Fletcher and Roberts in that series. Plus, we also lost a big song to an injury, of course, which is annoying. I'll give you one um, clue for this episode. We do sell a big player gives us a lot of money to spend in the next episode. Yeah, I'll just give a quick shout out to FIFA 22 years. Link down in the description. Go and follow him. Not follow, subscribe to him. Please. I'm beating him. I think. I don't know. Yeah, he wants to beat me, so go sub. So basically, this episode, I was focusing on getting a young player in the squad. Like, we get an offer for a leader, but we don't do anything about it. Uh, so we'll just sim a couple more days ahead. And then we do start the week today. As you know, we play three simmed games every episode. That's what I'm going to do, if you guys don't know. Um, who do we get an offer for here? Got an offer for Lee, which... Was nine inch K, but I did re re reject it because we need him, of course. So basically, now I was going to look at some young players from this. First player I look at was this Greg Dockery boy. I added to my transfer hub. And I just had to look at a lot of players here. Next player we looked at is that boy, but he was on loan. And I should have signed that Seardor, Seardor, whatever his name is, plays for Motherwell. That was really good. Like, he's young as well, 21. I was going to look at Alan Campbell, wasn't it? He's up a bit, yeah. Him, but and then, we didn't know, but that did say value is 1.5 mil. Very expensive. Connor Johnson had a look. Greg Docker I already have. And then we come off here. The we our thing and then we do now. I think we just train our boys again, obviously with the training present AA. Eh. With Anderson McLennan and Dean Campbell. Could get alright rates for actual McLennan there. Eh? This isn't bad. We need to rate the manager right now. Uh, what have, we do get an offer for him again here from Hamburg for 7.7k. No, not 7 point. 770,000 pounds. Now I think oh, we're having a meeting with the manager, of course, and he offers about amount. And then we come back with an offer. With, what was it? It was 1.1 mil and a release clause of 15%. And they just reject it and go away. So we're not going to be selling anyone again today. That's not the big player um, we will be selling. Well, now we're 83, I don't know how. Train a couple more boys again, I think. Yeah. Dean Campbell's nail up to 57 rated, if you've seen there. As long as we keep going on with young players, it'd be good. I decided to go to the transfer hub. I, I decided, obviously, it said. For that Alan Campbell, it's a 1.5 now. Like, is it really worth it? I don't think so. I tried to get my mom, but they weren't interested. And I went for Greg Docker. I was gonna get my mom, but then I just approached to buy. So we're in the office again with the Rangers manager that looks nothing like Steven Gerrard. Basically, what we offer first is, what is it? 
900,000 pounds. And they say one mil, but I think we count her here. Uh, smart players, I think we've done some smart plays here. Yeah, we just had a 10,000 on from the 900,000. I think, yeah, they did get accepted there. So we've now we've got a new sign in Greg Docker in this episode. I'm sorry I couldn't do a voice over the last episode because I'm so dumb. I didn't do anything for it. I didn't care. I'm so dumb. Very dumb. Right, so basically we tried to get him as a rotation player and they want him in a support and I just accept it anyway. And then contracts, we go with five years. And then obviously we don't have a release clause. So if he gets really good, and then we can't use him, of course. Well, he gets softer, and then we can't use him. It'll be rubbish, or it won't be worth it. Basically, that's a new sign in. Uh, Greg Docker, it wasn't it, his name? Yeah, I, I, I forgot already. Wow, I'm on. And I tried to look it on the news, of course. I think it was here actually. I forgot to do this at the time. I was thinking at this time that I was going to change the numbers, but I'm probably going to do that next episode. Next episode, we will change the numbers. Just comment down below what number you want our players to be. 66 um, rated there. Not bad, I guess. That's where team is looking good right now. I'll, I'll just say some. We have a lot of money for the next episode. So basically, now it's time to start getting into the season. First game against Hearts. And do we win? Comment down below if you think we'll win. And before we go into our first press conference, um, can we hit this video 10 likes? That'll be Thank great. Thank you all for joining okay. us. We'll, we'll start taking some questions now. 10 likes. Um, go and follow my Instagram. Link in the description or if I don't put it in. Aberdeen underscore everything, go follow it please. Thanks guys. Right, so we obviously do like our bloody blast stuff, whatever, with the press conference. If you wonder where my, my manager is so strange because, because I forgot to change him. You can see we're talking about Greg Docker here. I didn't know what to say, I think I picked, what did I pick? Yeah, he'll prove the right man, I picked that. And that's, that's all, first thank you guys. All done. And we're going into our first game of the season, I think now. Or no, we did get a message from Ojo. It was saying like, he wasn't feeling 100% in the pre-season and all that. And then, and then I just put, what was it? No, what did I put? If I do it, just saying sorry if it pauses for a because I sometimes have to think about things for too long. Right, basically, now I think it's time to go into the first game of the season. Obviously, we're going to sim it. And unfortunately, we come away with a 1-1 draw with Naomi again did get injured in that game. He was very annoying. We'll find out here how long he's injured for. We do go up to 84 rated as a manager. As you can see in the bottom right there, Dean Cabo is now 57 rated. Annoyingly, Naomi again has suffered a broken toe and will be out for 6 weeks. Very annoying. As you can see we've got 2.34 million pounds in the bank. Got the team, you know. Got Dean Campbell, he's 57. Got Docker, he's gone out one actually. Which is good for Fletcher. Even better. I, I don't know why. I put Ojo on the left and was thinking of bringing Docker into the middle. I don't know why. I thought Ojo could play like the left mid at the time. And then I think I'm like, I'm not gonna do that. That's kind of dumb. Basically, we skip ahead. I think we're going to change here. Yeah, 
Welcome to another training present. I should make up a new training present to be fair. As you can see, I actually had to stop a clock there, that's why it kind of went. I speed it up there. So, um, I think it just is when I decided, yeah, to change the audio. Who, who did I play? I think I played McLaren, and yeah. Yeah, and then kept him on the bench. So I think we're going to make this one, to be fair. Kind of dumb playing all during that position, to be fair. Right, next game is against St. Mirren. I think we are away in this game. We are wasting six in the league right now. Yeah, it was away to St. Mirren. Can we get a result? Yes, we can. 2 0 with Hedges and Ferguson getting the goal. So that's our first win of the season, which is really good. I don't know how we went down to a 79 rated manager. Weird. You see, we're third in the league right now. More training coming in. Hopefully, gonna do the boys that really want to like get high rated. Like they're gonna be like really good youngsters. Probably Greg Docker as well would be quite a good player to get up to that stage too. Now I'll just have a look at how many injured players we have. Crazy. Same with Aberdeen in real life, they get so many injured players. That's what that's the annoying thing about doing some matches, but I think kinda makes it more harder, which is well, makes it more of a challenge which kinda makes it better for us. Because so uh, it's harder and I can't really do everything. Because Aberdeen don't have much squad depth, which is annoying. I was gonna try. I'm actually I've actually got plans to sign some free agents um in the next episode. If you guys want me to do that, comment down below. And uh, remember to comment down below um down below video ideas because obviously I can't make all the um, videos and if you're still here please subscribe and hit the notification bell please if you're still watching because the majority of my viewers watch like a minute of my videos which isn't very good and this is a big offer travel offer for Scott McKenna 5.5 million from real social dad whatever social dad I can't social dad can't even pronounce the name right so we go in the office yet again for like this 7 billion time in this video. We do offer a new transfer fee. This fee is a fee of 6 mil, I think I put 6 mil. And they do accept it. 6 million for Big Scott McKenna. 6 million pounds. A lot of money there. Wait, we get a message from Andrew Considine saying yeah, he, he's uh, feeling good. I put him on the bench again with Kilmarnock. No. I thought there was like some more young players. I don't know. So basically now we have obviously Scott McKenna's last game. I was gonna bench him but I'm like, it's not done. I did bench him, I think. Yeah, I gave Devlin a chance. Right, until last game of the episode. And unfortunately we do lose one now to the morning, which is unfortunate. And somehow we all go all the way up to 87. Message back from Con today. Saying that. We have our inbox, which was really the last thing in the episode. How big is that? Scott McKenna has sold for £6 million. So, yeah, guys, that's the end of the video. So guys, bye bye, it's the Dawn's Media and good.